we are absolutely not the only company who has sort of realized that you know that there is quite uh, that it's quite a decent start to start with a small business and go up it's much yeah. easier to do that than to start above you know in the upper sort of stratosphere and then come down because then you to the whole mindset and your infrastructure doesn't really support it so it can be done now how did we do it in our case uh, look, it was very simple, and uh, I don't know, you know, this is about giving advice to entrepreneurs, but uh, maybe, you know. Look, so from day one, the idea was that you need to get the product out, and the product that we wanted to get out and that we got out had to stand on its own. So it was always, the, there was always this realization, and I if we had any religion, the religion was, hey, uh, the product has to be usable and deployable immediately by the end user, okay? Uh, okay, end user being a company, yes, yeah. being a small company. And if we didn't have that, we didn't have anything. So we didn't want to do another OEM play. We didn't want to do you know, a white label to where you develop technology and then you deploy it or try to deploy it and somebody else controls your channel, you know, somebody else controls the sales force. So being there, done that, can you do a decent business? Absolutely, can you make money? Surely. Uh, is it truly satisfactory in the end? To me, it wasn't. But uh, maybe you know, again, that's just me. You know, but to me, I always sort of felt that the part that was missing from Rin Zero was a direct link to the customer, mm. and uh, sort of really sort of feeling their pain and really solving their issues directly, yeah. as opposed to indirectly through several layers of you know, sort of channel yeah, management yeah. of the infrastructure. Right. So that was it. So we just came up with a product that we believe was deployable. Mm. Again, time, uh, times were right, right? So the internet was about, Google was taking shape, so the long tail now was accessible through AdWords. Yeah. We were one of the very early merchants on, on, on Google. Yep. And uh, for this the longest time. This is in 2003, time, 2004? Yeah, right? yeah, exactly right. And, um, you know, we weren't the only ones, but we were sort of early enough, you know? Sure. And, um, you know, it actually worked for us, right? So we were able to get the word out, and if somebody was looking for a you know, toll-free number or a voicemail system or a fax system in those days, you know, would be easy to find. You optimized through search. We optimized through search initially, uh -huh. and it worked well for us. So that's how we got our few hundred customers and then thousand customers and so forth.